what are parallel ports now what is a port any any you know you will always see that in your system there will be a part where you can fix the peripheral devices you can connect the peripheral devices so for parallel i am saying if you want to connect the printer or the scanner you will use the parallel uh, port if you are connecting a keyboard or a mouse where you need a slow data rate you need serial so parallel for higher data rates so let me tell you first serial and parallel ports serial is one bit by one bit at a time that is you are sending zero serial zero will go one one will go zero one will go one by one sequentially that is the data is transmitting serially sequentially one by one but this zero one zero if you are sending at a at the same time this is called the parallel so you are sending 010 parallelly so parallel port is a type of interface for connecting the peripheral devices because computer need any computer need a keyboard or a mouse and their different printer etc to to get connected then only you know you can uh, utilize them because these are also the resources the parallel ports send multiple bits at the at, of data at the same time at once as opposed to the serial communication in which the bits are sent one at a time so parallel ports require multiple data lines because you know you are sending multiple data you need multiple cables and port connectors so you see here i am showing you the db25 this is db25 uh, parallel i am also showing you the db25 female and this is also i am showing you the db this is 36 this is also called the centronics port so this is uh, if you see here zero to seven bit these are dedicated for bit transfer and that is that is very important because in db9 we just had uh, the rs232 recommended standard of serial connection i'm just talking about db9 so seven seven were the control pins so there were nine pins nine pins only two pins because it was a full duplex full duplex communication so you have one bit to one pin to send one pin to receive so serial here you have Eight bits for transferring and receiving. So the most common parallel port is is a printer port known as the Centronics port. You will find it now in various systems. But uh, as I'm saying that the parallel port interface they are virtually non-existent now because the of the advent and the you know growth of universal serial bus devices along with the network printing using the Ethernet. also the wifi connected printers now you just give the print command from your system and it will it will get printed on the printer so there are examples of parallel communication protocols like isa ata scsi pci and we have ieee uh, 488 so isa ata scsi pci ieee uh, 488 all are there so let me tell you about the serial also just to just to complete the discussion there are certain recommended standard there are certain protocols so let me combine them also and just tell you that just to have you can have an idea that there are certain standards and protocols in serial like can like we have the uh, ethernet uh, 12c spi then rs232 usb one wire sata etc 